right? It's a sad day, but a good day. I sold my beetle, as you remember from the last vlog, I kind of showed you, we took it for a drive and everything, and a guy came today from Alberta, and he bought it, and it's going to a good home. He's like a Volkswagen guy, so I feel good about that, and... Not only is he a Volkswagen, he's a German, he's an authentic <laughs> Yeah, he's in his blood, <laughs> yeah. So yeah, it's on its way to Alberta right now to live a happy life. Good, we can't drive it, as I maybe said before, because of this one. So it's just gonna sit around for like oh, summer until last curse line can go for like little driving dates. It was just better being sold and going to someone that will drive it and enjoy it. And um, I guess just in the future, we'll just maybe buy another little vintage car. Porsche. <laughs> the dream, <laughs> but it was a little sad seeing it go. I've had it since I was like 19 and I'm 36 this year. So <laughs> it's quite a long time. I have to go to the bank and everything now, do all that stuff. So as if I could guys give you guys a little update, doing a little planning, Rowan turns one next week and I've ordered a cake and I'm trying to figure like a little cupcake situation for her first little cake. Cause they just, she'll have to get her own little cake so it doesn't destroy the nice one I ordered for my parents nice and joy. And Curtis, not just me. So anyways, I'm gonna go and run my errands. I'll see you guys later. Hello, back home with this one. Um, yeah, I just went out, ran the errands as I told you I was gonna do, and then we did a little like detour at uh, Holt Run Fruit. Oh, Very cute. Did a little shoe shopping. I found myself a pair of sneakers. These sneaks. The Roger, is that what they're called? Yeah, the Roger Center Court by On Running. They must be Roger, Roger Federer. Federer. Well, yeah. they're Swiss. Yeah. And Cloud Tech. I don't know. They're really, they're super comfortable. They even have like actual runners. But yeah, these are going to be so nice for like walking around with Rowan in the summer. Look at the inside of the box too, like clouds. Hello. It is Thursday. Um, we're just about to go to the spa. We're going to... Uh, Circle Wellness in Vancouver. It's kind of like a hidden, like Scandinavian spa kind of. But yeah, they have like um, hot and cold pools, like a sauna. Um, but it's highly like highly popular and recommended. So we'll see. This is my Christmas gift from Curtis. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, a couple hours we get in there. Um, yeah, it should be nice and relaxing. We just dropped Rona off on my mom's. So we just went to her pediatrician appointment, her 12 month checkup. Which went great, except she doesn't she doesn't care about going and getting her shots and all that stuff. But when she goes and sees the pediatrician, she just like uh, has a meltdown. I think it's because they wear the shield and a mask and like ha you know the gloves and the whole thing. I think she's like intimidated when she goes. Nicest lady, nicest pediatrician ever. Um, so yeah, I'm just excited that her she had a good checkup and everything looks good and developmental wise, she's at like a 15 18 month. Um, level already <laughs> anyways i just said to slow down she's yeah but everything else is good yeah she's like good for height head head measurements all that stuff um but yeah i'm just looking forward to some r and r now no baby for a couple hours <laughs> we haven't had like a day date for like a long time hey mm -hmm. yeah it's gonna be nice so anyways we're just gonna go and relax now and um My yeah we're I tired three hours of sleep last Rowan night. was up in the middle of the night no, she didn't go to sleep until... Well, no, sorry. She did. She slept until, like, 12. And she's then she was teething. up from 12 to, like, 4. Yeah, she's doing a little teething. She's getting, Which like, the... she go to bed till 4. Yeah. So, she just has, like, a little... She, the night before, she slept 12 hours straight. It was amazing. Slept until 8. But, I don't know. Yesterday, I think she's... Because she's... Pediatrician says also because she's getting these teeth in. Like, this, not the front two tooth, but, like, the ones next. And maybe even possibly, like, the canine might be coming in, too. So... That one's supposed to be difficult, so like getting your molars. Um, so that could be it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah Definitely so. was teething because I gave her Tylenol. Yeah, and then she, was she was fine after. Yeah. Poor thing. So, anyways, hope she just sleep today. She also didn't really have a nap this morning, so <laughs> my mama has her now. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna go and relax now. I'm gonna fall asleep in the pool. That's fine. I'll just make sure you don't drown. Thank you. <laughs>
So, what do you think? Yeah. Yeah, so nice. It's like super relaxing. We're just the two of us in here. Obviously in the news. <laughs> We're on Gravel Islands. We just got here. It's not raining. Bonus. Um, we're gonna go have a bakery. We're gonna go to the bread affair. They have what? Are they, I don't even know how to pronounce it. Kun Aman pastries. They have some special ones. We're gonna go to the children's market and the actual Gravel Island, like the food market. And yeah. And here's Rowan. It's Rowan. <laughs> okay. So let's go. Their cells can be filled with ducks and yeah, children. Children, well, yeah, but there's always the babies around here. That's cool for the water yeah, smart. Hmm. All right, to the kids' market. So what'd you get? Okay, so we went to the kids' market and they have. Like all things, but Rome has a birthday next week, so we're gonna wait. So she gets. But we know where all the fun things live, and we decided though to get her a little day sack. It has like a little, um, like leash. a leash. <laughs> they call it a rain, but just so that she can walk by herself, we don't have to worry about her like jumping off a sidewalk or or anything. Um, I just remember having one of these when I was a kid. You know, my parents would take us to like a busy place or like Disneyland or something, you know, like I remember my sister had one too. Um, yeah, so we're gonna put this on. We're gonna try it out here. I'm pretty sure it's easy to get out of this packaging. Yeah. You might have to rip this part. So. Okay. You got it on? Yeah. We'll see it in action. No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Freedom! Yeah. <laughs> Are you free? Do you want to take a picture? Look at you go. 
<laughs> All right, what's the verdict? Uh, we like it. She likes to just run around. She has no idea that we have a leash on her. <laughs> and then it's also really handy because like, you can put she can put her toys and whatever else in it, and it grow like is for like one to ages one to four or something. So yeah, she'll grow into it and use it for other things. And it's a little ladybug. <laughs> Click the link below and use code Rossi. No, whatever. Five Anyways, five five. The verdict is that we really like the backpack. No idea she has a leash on and it's a it's a win-win for both of us i would say and she looks so freaking cute with it on <laughs> feels a little demoralizing though when you're walking with it doesn't it no, no. it's just a, like extra little bit of safety because she doesn't know understand. no no i understand i yeah. totally understand but i mean just feels weird doing it but nobody gives a shit i'm no sure i think ron did you like it Freedom. Freedom. Should we go? We're gonna go now. So I'm gonna have a nap, hopefully. She's pooped out. Get warmed in the car. And then, uh, yeah, we're just gonna head home, I think, really. But it was a nice couple hours on uh, Granville Island, I have to say. Oh, Mrs. Mom's chai tea. Not for Rowan. Okay, see ya. See you later. Hi. I'm making dinner. I had like a. We used this the other day for Rowan. I got this, this is an easy, quick weeknight dinner. I usually try it with my own sauces, my own bolognese and stuff, but I got this because it also has kale and spinach in it. Um, and very little sugar. So that, we're having that with these porcini mushroom ravioloni, raviolis, whatever you want to call them. Um, they're gigantic. So there's, a few for us each, and then some salad. Um, so they're fresh, so they won't take very long. It's mostly us waiting for the water to boil. And we have dessert, <laughs> the pastries from earlier. And, um, oh, we went to the soup stock, or the stock market, sorry, and grab a tuna. I got like, a couple of soups for lunch this week. Carrot, a broccoli, they also have like they do really great butters and like own mustards and anything and they do like stock um so i got a fresh herb butter and so we got some olives we got some bread and stuff back there so yeah we're set for like a couple days of meals and i also got these for rowan the other day at the grocery store it's just like um broccoli grounds there's lots of protein I figure it's good for us good for her um yeah just something easy to put together some nights if i running out of time for dinner <laughs> and she, we just discovered that, like a week or so ago that she loves cottage cheese which is great because it's high protein so winning hello i just got my hair done feels <laughs> went really big with the blowout <laughs> But it feels so nice to get my hair done and went a little bit lighter got a little lighter closer to the roots um yeah and just trying to still grow out the um, like the bangs i had before like the fringe so it would be all like one length and then eventually like more of a blunt cut um and then also yeah just all the baby hides it helps hides the baby hairs anyways um but yeah i love it always so much volume when i go and i can never get this much volume at home so um, yeah, just going to head home now and have some lunch. I am starving. Went a little bit longer because he had to leave some of the um, the foils in for a little bit longer than he thought. Um, just because my hair wasn't taking it in so quickly. So, yeah, I'm going to go home and eat. Um, I'm starving. So I think I might do one of those soups we got yesterday at the market. Um, see which one. I think Curtis is going to have some for lunch. So I'll see which one he opened up and that's the one I'm gonna have. So I will see you guys back at home. <laughs> Curse's um, stepmom dropped off a couple of things for Rowan, <laughs> including this jingle jangle bracelet. And we're watching, we discovered waffles and mochi or mo mochi on um, Netflix. It's so cute, it's kind of like a Sesame Street, but um, yeah, I don't know. We're only like 10 minutes into the first episode. And I, already, I already really enjoy this show. <laughs> yeah. And what are we going to have for dinner? 
Chinese food. Yeah, someone had a craving for Chinese food over there, so. Not, not all Chinese I just want the uh, chow mein, really. <laughs> that's what I have a hankering for. Oh, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to order that. Rowan also likes Chinese food. It was chow mein? Yeah, she loves noodles of any sort. That's her Sunday. So, anyways, that's what we're going to do. Just want to jump on and say, end the vlog. And say, thanks for watching again. Hope you guys enjoy it. And we'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And leave a comment. Hit so, the notification bell, yes, please. Yes. Helps our channel to grow. So, see you in the next one. Ciao! Ciao.